If you use Microsoft desktop versions, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, here is something you absolutely need to know. It has to do with importing and exporting your quick access toolbar in these different apps. I'm going to start off with Word as my example. This is going to be very fast. I'm not covering how to organize your quick access toolbar. I will show you how to add something right here. Here is my quick access toolbar going from the left to the right. I have put it below the ribbon. If you wanted to, I could click here and put it back above the ribbon. But I use this because in Microsoft Word, take a guess how many commands there are, over 1,700 commands. I frequently find myself changing the orientation from portrait to landscape. So I'm going to right click on orientation and add it to my quick access toolbar. Here it sits now over here. I've got at work a lot of commands in my quick access toolbar. And the other day I happened to, they just disappeared. No rhyme or reason. I don't know if it was an update, but they were gone. That is a lot of time to spend putting them back and rearranging the order. So you want to export them first. Here's how you export quick access toolbar, hit the drop down arrow, go all the way down and click more commands. When more commands loads, look over to the left, make sure you're on the quick access toolbar. Perfect. Now come over here to the right. Here's everything on your quick access toolbar. I'm not doing it, but here's how you move stuff around and put it in a different order. But down here, I have the option to import and export. I want to export all my customizations. I would encourage you in real life to put this in a OneDrive account if you have a OneDrive account. But for right now, I am just going to stick this in my downloads. So I have it saved in my downloads. So here's what's going to happen. I'm going to actually reset. So act like I got an update, act like something happened in my Microsoft Word. Take a look at my quick access toolbar. It has the default icons in there, auto save, save, undo, and repeat. Those are the four options. Those two are grayed out because there's nothing to undo or repeat right now. So now I find myself to be really aggravated. I don't want to spend time remembering what did I even have and what order were they in. So here are the steps. Drop down arrow for the quick access. Go to more commands, same steps. Make sure you're on quick access. Now you want to do an import the customization file. Go find your file. Watch this. Open. Click yes. Click OK. Take a look at my quick access toolbar. I've got all my quick access toolbar commands back on it. I did it for Word. Here's Excel, my quick access toolbar. So you have to do it for each application, Word. Excel and PowerPoint. And again, this is desktop only. Definitely need to do this because I'm in these desktop apps all the time. Thank you for your time. If you have any questions, please put them in the comments box below and my online training classes are available. Take care.